let's make some grilled pork skewers. Look at this with some onion oil. There you go. Close up. Okay, let's get started. Here I have one pound of pork shoulder. I thinly slice like this. See how thin? It's like, like a little see-through thin right here. It's going to soak up all the marinade. It's going to be really yummy. Okay, this is about one pound. I minced up some uh, shallots and lemongrass in here. This is about uh, a little bit over one tablespoon. Everything in. I'm going to marinate it with some oyster sauce. Do two tablespoons of oyster sauce. Two tablespoons of fish sauce. Any brand is fine. Okay, that's one and two. All purpose sweetener, or you can use honey. Do four tablespoons of this. One, two, three, and four. And then five spice. Do one teaspoon of five spice. Mm, that smells so good. Put on some gloves. Love using my garlic oil for any marinade. I'm also going to do one tablespoon of my garlic oil. Okay. Glove on. Mix. Mix it up really well. And I'm going to let this marinade for about 20 minutes. But if you have the time, you can do this overnight. It's going to taste even better. Okay, here I have some wooden skewers. I soaked it for about 10 minutes in uh, water. Now this, this here has been sitting for 20 minutes. Now I'm going to start just like this. Easy peasy. Just like this. You just weave it. Push it down. Continue until you fill it up. Try not to overfill because you want it to cook uh, evenly. Since it's pork, you want everything to cook evenly. See, you just poke. Here, let me show you. Poke through and just twist and twist, twist, just like that. You want it to be separated so everything can um, be evenly cooked. Do the same for all of them. Just weave. Okay. Yeah, I think this is good enough. Let's start on another one. See, look. You don't want to overfill, just like this. Okay. Let's continue. I'll do another one for you. See, it doesn't matter if the uh, pieces are small. You can always, you know, play with it. There you go. That's one. Just 
to, to be honest with you, I do not eat pork. I usually do this with uh, beef. But uh, I just make something different for you guys. For those of you that like uh, pork, you can do this. Well, my husband, he eats pork, so I just make this for him. I don't know. I just don't like pork. I don't know. See, this can fit like three, four, three to four uh, pieces. Just have everything separated. If it's hanging like this, you can just poke it one more time on the uh, the tip. There you go. See? Okay, all done. For about one pound of meat, I made eight skewers. I was going to grill it outside today, but it's really hot. Texas weather is like crazy hot. Crazy, crazy hot. So I'm going to put this in my air fryer under grill. Okay, my air fryer is on. I'm going to do a grill on high for 10 minutes first. Okay, guys, this was about six minutes. I opened it up to check on it. Now I'm going to flip so they can cook evenly. See the char on this side? It's perfect. Uh, depending on your grill. This is a ninja right here. My grill is a ninja. And I'm going to flip and finish cooking. Now we're going to finish up cooking until it's uh, beat to like 10 minutes mark. So when I flipped, it was 6 minutes. And I'm going to do it for another 4 minutes. Okay, it's off the grill. I made some scallion oil. And I'm just going to put some... Uh, on here. This scallion oil is really easy to make. It's just um, one bunch of scallion and then you just put about a tablespoon of uh, oil, any type of oil you like, and just heat for 40 seconds and that's it. Look how yummy it is. It looks really good, and I know it tastes really good, but I just don't eat it. I just don't like pork. There you go. All done. Okay, guys, everything is done, but I'm not going to do a taste test this time. But I can assure you this is really, really good. So make sure you try this, and I'll see you next time, and follow for more. Bye!